Well, construction industry has enormous impact. Uh, it is responsible, and this, this is a generic figure which goes across the continent. So um, uh, in UK, it's responsible for about 45% uh, of overall carbon emissions. So think about all the human activities. This includes travel, food production, clothing industry, um, um, everything that, that humans do. 45% of the overall activity is due to construction industry. Uh, and this, this includes the production of materials, if you like, uh, the, the building materials. So we have a huge impact, and whatever we do as, as an industry um, has a huge significance. Uh, one of the other um, huge impact is also the waste. The, the overall production of waste uh, in the UK, again, uh, about a third uh, is due to construction uh, industry. So we have, um, as an activity, if you like, we have a, a large responsibility, but also a large area of influence. So what we do uh, will really count. That's why, that's why I do what I do. Another timber-based building is a Mayfield School. Um, and this is where, where um, I hope um, our, our um, co-panelist is um, joining us from. Um, this is another school in London, uh, much larger than the Stabern. Um, school project, and as you see, um, it's it's um, uh, relatively simple in shape again. So we tried again to to reduce the requirements of the building uh, through the design, uh, but as I said, it's hosting a much larger number of people. So it's up to two and a half thousand people. So we had to um, expand a little bit um, in space. Uh, this project is about 17 million pounds, and um, it's a year and a half construction program. Well, you can build a sustainable building, but it will not be the optimum sustainable building if you don't include the whole team early on and throughout the process and uh, teach the people how to use.